You got a Korok seed. Bye bye. Hey guys and gals, I'm Pal, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. When we last left off, I conquered some shrines, I found a memory, and that's it. This time, we're heading over to that island. Because it's interesting, and and that's it. That's all. <laughs> uh, I've never used one of these boats before, but I've seen them used. I'm just not sure how to get them off of the, the beach. Oh, that's how, oh, it's how, how wind actually works. That's how you do it. Okay. Apparently, I haven't seen one of these things used. But yeah, we're heading over to that island because it looks interesting. And also, I think it may have something to do with a quest. So, we're doing that now. Can I actually do... No, I can't. I have to use it as wind actually works. Well, that's nice. It's not like, uh, it's not like Wind Waker where the physics were really weird. Also, in between episodes, I forgot, I sold a bunch of my, my junk, so I now have 1,800 rupees again. And then also, I've been a little bit tired of how many times in an episode I try to equip different gear, and I end up just losing myself in the menu. I try to find specific clothing sets, and it's just a bad time. So, I color-coded all of my clothing in between episodes. So, the Hylian set, which is primarily used for fighting, it is all red. The Zora armor is already blue, so I didn't change it at all. Uh, the stealth gear is now black or dark gray, whichever you prefer. And then the climber set is brownish tan, because that is the color of stone. So now... I should be able to navigate the menu without losing myself in it, which is really nice. It'll save me a lot of hassle in episodes, and it will make me much more apt to changing my clothing around, since this game really pushes that. It really pushes adapting your armor towards the situation. It's not like older games where you would just get the, the fire, the fire tu tunic, and then you would leave that on whenever there was fire. This, you actively have, have to switch your stuff. I may have to beach that in a second. That's a really easy chest. With a purple rupee in it, okay. So let's not... Oh, that's... Okay, that's a bit awkward. Let's get up here. And m maneuver our... our raft onto this beach. I've heard a couple things about this island. And I've also seen a little bit of it played. To you who has who has traveled to this island. I present you with a challenge. In your travels, you're, you've relied on the equipment you found along the way. Here, you must cast this equipment aside and face this trial with only your wits and, what, and whatever you can scavenge. Offer up the orbs to the three altars on this island. Only then can will I acknowledge your skill and return you your gear. So yeah, that's that's what I've heard about this this island is that you lose your gear and you have to make do with what you're given. And so I'm going to be doing this in my last. Wow, that's so cool. We're forced to just cut, start over. Whoa. Bleh. <laughs> I didn't expect that, man. <laughs> uh, don't do that to me, game. So I don't have any gear at all. Not even f any food. Nothing. Just my runes, an ore, and my wits. And this will be the last thing that we do before I begin the, uh, the Akala region. I believe it's called Akala. But yeah, this will be the last thing I do, because I realized that if I don't tie up all the loose ends now... This thing's metal. This thing's metal. Oh, boy. Yup! Okay, I've never seen them do that. Kill him. Kill him. Oh, come on. Uh, oh, I got him. I got him. I got him. Ooh, nice. Can I take their stuff? But yeah, I realized if I keep lo leaving loose ends up like this, then I will... 
I will always have loose ends to keep going back to, and then I'll never get anything done. So, I'm tackling things as I see them, and then we can move on to the new area. Okay, there's you. Whoa. I've never seen you guys move before. That's neat. But seriously, you're getting... You're getting wearisome on me. So let's take you out with this ore. And you're done. We're given a chest. So let's see how quickly I can move through this. Link stubs his toe. Traveler sword. Nice. An iron... Uh, crab. Need to grab everything at my disposal. Hydromelon. A vault fruit, which is just dragon fruit. A bunch of new things on this tropical island. Let's take these spears. Oh, no, 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 no. I need to drop this, don't I? Let's drop this on the ground. Oh, let's drop the shield too. Drop. Oh, I almost bit the bit the bullet there. Where where'd my sword go? Did it destroy my sword? Uh, remove. Where's my? I I dropped my sword, right? Uh, did I just? lose my my sword I think I just lost my sword okay well apparently that can happen that's that stinks okay so let's see if there's anything in these crates like I said I want to clear this out as quickly as possible I keep thinking that that lantern is an enemy okay so there are three shrines that we need to offer orbs up to kind of vague but I'll roll with it I guess we'll just skirt the island in a counterclockwise fashion like this. These are bones. I assume they'll be animated. There they are. Uh, I should probably equip a stick. It's kind of weird that Bakoblin arms are actually desired now. The thing just reanimated itself. Okay, there's a big tree. There's some choo-choos. I'm, I'm seeing nothing that resembles a shrine. And I assume that's where we're going to be offering things. Well, there's a boss that I'm not going to tackle right now. That would be... Oh, wait. No, I have to tackle him. <gasps> oh, he has one of the balls on him! <laughs> I have to kill him with my terrible gear. Okay, but certainly not yet. Certainly I don't have to do that yet. In fact, certainly... Uh, this is bad. Certainly, I, I should be able to kill him with these boulders. That's why they're giving those to me. Okay, kill him. They're still asleep. There's the shrine. Oh. Man, he still has health. Wow. I thought the other one died in one hit, though. Why is that, that one different? Okay. Okay. So we're going to sneak up. We're going to pick up one of those, one of those canisters. And kill them all. Whew! Let's pick up this too. That's a bad idea. That was a bad idea. Kill him. Switch over to Magnesis. And hit them all. Does this work? It does work. Yes. I haven't really used these as a weapon much, but they do a lot of damage. A lot of damage. Wow. And there's a shrine up here, or an altar, I guess. Uh, you know what? Let's not throw this quite yet. Not, not quite yet. Because I can use that as a weapon against the giant guy, right? Okay, what's over this way? Anything I should be concerned with? No, just a tree. Just a tree. So let's see if there's a higher place up there. Let's see if I can kill that guy with these stones. Because if I could, that would be great. Let's push him down. Hit him. Please hit him. Uh, not, didn't really work there. Uh, what about this one? Will this one work? Wait. Please hit him. It's on a um, bad trajectory. Well, well, uh, what with this? I'm not s entirely sure how I can kill him normally. Don't break! 
Okay, good. I don't think I could kill him. You don't see me. He sees me. Can I kill him with this? I can't see his health. That did a lot of damage, actually. Maybe I could... Maybe I can kill him. With just some good old... Bomby know-how. I might be able to cheese my way through this. I have a better way. Here. Wait a minute. And... Don't get out of the way. Don't be smart. I'm over here. That did nothing. That did absolutely nothing. Here, should I try it again? I may, may want to try it again. Okay. Yes! That does work! That works so well! Thing. Okay, it's not even worth it. Actually, I think I was hitting his armor, too. No, no, get back in the range. No. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, and it's way over there, too. Okay, we'll wait for him to get over here. He's a bit stuck. He's actually bringing, he's playing soccer, right? He's playing soccer. He's actually looking at it. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, need to be careful of that. Oh, no. Really? <gasps> Link? <laughs> what was that? Man, oh, he sat on me. Da 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 do 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 da 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 do 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 da 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 do 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 da 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 do 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 da da yeah, you guys see exactly what I'm planning. Ba ba da 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 ra da ra da do da 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 da. <laughs> okay, let's see this. Fly. That was a bit too short. Let's try that again. Da 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 da. Ha! Direct hit! That's a one! Now, did he actually take damage from that? No, but he'll take damage from this. Da 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 da! Da da da! Here, I'll just get, I'm just gonna get into his range. Hey, buddy! Goodbye! Aw, oh, that was too far! Uh. Oh, that kind of worked, I guess. I probably shouldn't have him up here, because that means I only get one shot at my my boulder. So let's let's knock these down and get and get ready for him. Get down there. This two. This two. Get down there. Just. Okay, there. There. That should be a direct hit. Yeah! That was a perfect hit. Missed him. But I still saved my weapon. Okay. Oh, it hit him on the way down! Nice! Oh, and it's still hitting him. Really? That is good damage. Okay, let's... Okay, save another hit just to redirect it, which I'll need to. This will hit him straight on. Yes! Very good. This is working out way better than that last that last attempt. Also, about that last attempt, I had to, uh... How that works... Get off that thing, Link! How that works is, uh... I actually have to... What, what just happened? That was weird. I have to redo the entire, uh, the entire island when that happens. So, if I fail at once... No, no, get up here. What are you doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm constantly worried about him resetting. 
Goodbye. Don't hit me. Hit this. Okay. Oh, yes! Good damage. And he's down. Let's... One, two, three, four, five. That's a lot. Save one hit to redirect it. Oh, need to. Oh, good damage. Okay. Okay, save a, save a hit. Just to redirect it. And that's it. He's dead. <sighs> I cannot believe that I did that. I got a Dragon Bone Boko Bow, a bunch of Escargot, no weapons. Oh, no, no, never mind. I got a Boko Club. That is that is good to have. And I have this orb, which I'll take up to the top. Oh, this, this trial is a third of the way done. A third of the way done. I'm not sure where we are on time. Uh, I, I'll admit I did not start a timer for this episode because I was a bit dumb. But I think that once we... Don't you dare. Where are you going? Where are you going? I think that once we get this... Well, actually, no. I, th I think I just won't cut this up. Because I don't know how Future Pal is going to edit this. And this is all one big mission. So, I don't think I'll do an intro or outro. Uh, Future Pal, just cut it to your discretion. I think that works. And now, after one of the most awkward boss battles, we have our first orb. One down, two to go. Go, go, go! That one Pikmin is such a trooper! Kill him! Kill him! What? What Pikmin just died? Outcropping of rock over there, we might have to check that out! What on earth was that? What on earth? What? What? What was that? <laughs> 